This is a $49 hotel room, folks, in Phnom Penh. This is the Palace Gate Hotel and Residence. We've got to get out of here because we're leaving today. We're going back to see Reap. But this is an excellent $49, $49 hotel room. And I think it is one of the best value places that we've stayed in and most comfortable as well. As a matter of fact, let's get cracking in to the bathroom. We've just washed because we've got to get out of here. Look at the size of this bathroom. Nice, um, what do you call that? Thing. <laughs> uh, basin, you know what I'm talking about, to put all your stuff, that looks like a fridge but it's not, it's a cupboard hiding up the, the tap bit. Um, this shower is nice and big, although it does piss water, uh, it does leak a little bit down there because it doesn't close, but it is a really, really nice room. The water pressure is beautiful, it is amazing. Um, you get all of this lovely storage as well here. I mean, there's a lot, this, now this is a small hotel room, but it is laid out uh, exquisitely, I reckon. The use of space is excellent. You get a safe. Oh, look how many people are going to bring jackets and stuff to hang up there? That's magnificent. And you've got another cupboard here with some. What are they? Is it a gas mask? Just in case the cold war kicks off, is it? Oh, fire escape hood. That's very kind of them. That's excellent. And some shoes in case you need some shoes and you've got the power point there if you need to charge them up. Coming into the room. Oh, hang on a second. There's a bloody kitchen. A little kitchenette, how nice is this? So look, look at again, all the, you've got pots and, not pots and pans, what have you got? Plates and bowls and all sorts of stuff. You've got gas struts in here, just like the old VS Corridor boots. Glasses, wine glasses. This is very, 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 oh, there we go. Pots, pans and a saucepan, fantastic, and a range hood. And an induction cooktop with a four burner, I mean, <coughs> Four burner in a tiny little place like this. How good is that? You get a microwave. So that's really, really handy if you're here for a couple of days and you want to reheat some food. You can fire it up in this. Is that a microwave? Stand surround, surround. It's a surround sound microwave with no turntable. There you go. It's a static one, albeit it says surround. I've never seen that. Brian, maybe we should invest. It hasn't got a dishwasher, has it? That'd be, that'd be outrageous if it does. No, it doesn't. Look how big the sink is. This kitchen is better laid out than a one in our apartment, I reckon. Because there's more stuff, there's more bench space. Coming into the main area here, this is quite pleasant. Table and chair, you know what to do at a table and chair. You sit and you ponder. We've got a, a very, very modern flat screen TV, which has got super fast internet. So if you wanna watch YouTube or as we did yesterday for a bit, we watched Thomas the Tank Engine, the Ringo Starr version. Max is getting hooked. I don't mind it. Um, this bed, Oh, so comfortable. Like, it was very, very comfortable. Like, you see there's some, some, some bounce here? Like, it's not just like sleeping on a rock. Yeah. You get a bloody couch! Not just any couch. First of all, there's a Srace Art on it. Mm -hmm. But there's a, it's a, what do you call that? It's an L shape or with a chase. It's a proper chase lounge. What with a, chase? with a, chase. <laughs> with a rank, a rank. And, uh, and a, a glass table. And just like Kramer, you'll sense that it's there. I like this table. It's nice, isn't it? And you've got a rug under it. How, how good's that? I'm going to buy this at home. No. Because we've got him. He needs to play his trains. You going on a bus today? Bus. You going on a bus? Yeah, you're going on a bus. I know. I've got to hurry this up. This wooden thing to put the suitcase on. We've got a desk and a chair. So if you don't want to sit at the table and chair... You can sit here at the desk and test. So you've even got sit. You have three sitting options for forty nine dollars. Trains. Table and chair. Trains. Trains. Desk and chair, or couch and leisure. Couch and leisure. We've got this sort of bizarre corner over here, which is sort of impeded by this pole. But I won't take marks off it because it's not really being used for anything. Albeit, hey. it is quite. <laughs> it is quite an odd feature. The hotel pole. Air conditioner keeps this room very, very comfortable without having to blast it, which is excellent. You've got this view here. The view is pretty good. This doesn't lock, I don't know why. But you're right out onto the street here. We're level one. You can sort of see some bits and pieces of Phnom Penh as we pan around this way and that way. Uh, and actually, we've got four seating options. You've got a table and chair outside, albeit you are quite snug here. But that's okay, because you're only gonna sit here to have a dart. Oh. Do not throw your butts on the ground. Please put them in an ashtray. Oh, and put your butt in an ashtray. 
That's what, that's what the sign says. Put your butt in an ashtray. <laughs> um, so you've got an extra sitting option, a bonus, a bonus sitting option. Um, a couple of other things that are really, really good about this place. I was a bit shitty because I thought, oh, how are you going to charge your things? They've thought of it. They've got power points integrated into the side tables. You can plug your stuff in there. That's, and, it's, and it's hidden. It's bloody man. Table, table. Here, give them to mummy. Give them to me. Here, here. Oh, no. Put them. Da, 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 da. Uh, and you've got that over here. So we've just got our charging stuff here, ready to go into the backpack for the bus. Another one there. That is super, super clever. And nice decorative lamps as well. So they go on and off, so now it's on, now it's off. Now you've seen it all. Um, and some artwork, we had some artwork over here. Yeah, it looks good. And two things that I think are really, really good that I'll finish off with. The roof is white and not mouldy or yuck. The floor is also a nice white tile. And it is so nice, light and bright in here. Even though you've got one window all the way over there, the whole place just feels nice and airy and luxurious. And that is something that we haven't experienced too often in Cambodia, because you've usually got a dark floor or a bloody wooden roof. I think this is an excellent spot for 40, what's it, 49 bucks, 40? Just a 50. 50 bucks. 50 bucks! Be nicer than the last time we stayed at. Sorry, Jet. <laughs> That's one of my sister's house. No, Jet's, Jet's place. Yeah, I know it's guest house. Jet's is a guest house. Different different market. Anyway, I've got to pack this shit. We've got to go. Oh, yeah, Jet, Jet's a lovely bloke. Very, very good bloke. Anyway, if you like this place, Palace Gate Hotel and Residence near the Palace Gate, I suppose. We've got to get on the bus back to see you, mate. We'll see ya. Let's go.